this handsome young man here uh, is going to teach us a little bit about cat scratch disease and paranoid oculoglandular syndrome. Yeah. And I have with me <laughs> a younger, better looking doctor than me. But we're, we're going to be talking a little bit about the uh, cat scratch disease. So show us where you got the cat scratch. And, and that was, I think, like on Tuesday, if I remember right, right? Yeah, yesterday or today. No, because I didn't know it was yesterday. Two days ago. Two days ago. Got it. All right, good. And, uh, and then you started to get some swelling in your neck. Show us on your neck where the swelling is. Right, right here. Yeah, right there. And and actually, when we feel on it, yeah, we can feel it. We can when we actually feel on it, it's definitely, it's definitely swollen. And then when I push right here, you got like a big swelling right there, and that hurts you, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that hurts. That's preauricular <laughs> swelling. And then about the same time, your eyes started to get infected and red. Can you look at that wall over there? Yeah. And then look at me with your eye, yeah. And then let's see the, the conjunctiva of the lower eyelid. Can you just flip that down there? Yeah, yeah, look at that, it's nice and red. So Ashton, would you do a little teaching on us as, as to what's going on here? <laughs> so. so basically, um, you get cat scratch disease by getting a scratch from a cat. Yeah. All right, and so basically it's a bacteria um, called Barnella hensula um, that can get into the bloodstream and cause um, some lymphadenopathy where we see the um, swelling of his uh, preauricular lymph nodes as well as he has some posterior cervical. And, and he actually has a, a lymph node down under under here too. Correct. He's got a submandibular node too. And so uh, tell, what about the paranoid ocular glandular syndrome though? That's so, yeah. That's kind of special. I mean, I haven't seen that for forever. Correct. So basically, um, they can you can get uh, redding or conjunctivitis of the eye uh, from the bacteria. Um, and it can have some perianal drainage correct, from the as eye. He has, um, yeah, um, you can see some crusting in that eye. Correct. Yeah, and so a lot of the times um, it's transmitted from um, you actually touching the the scratch uh, part of the skin and actually touching your eye. Yes, yeah, so you well. can actually transmit it, or Correct. the cat could lick your eye. Correct. Yes. Yeah, and or the, eye, the cat could scratch your eye too. Yes. Does your eye hurt? A little bit. Okay. <laughs> all right. But definitely, definitely, you got you definitely have some swelling here. And because um, we can actually, I think we might be able to see that with the camera. Yeah, actually, you can see it with the camera. Mm -hmm. And then, uh, but, and you definitely can have, I can feel just like a big node, like sitting right. Yeah, I, I can feel, I can feel like a, a big area of swelling, like right there on your head. So, well, you know what? I am so proud of you. And I want to thank you and your mom for letting us do this. Because you're going to teach doctors and nurses all about this disease. Is that good? This will be on YouTube, ain't it? Yeah, you're going to be on YouTube, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to be You're going to be a YouTube, YouTube rock star. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, I'm going to watch YouTube a lot. Don't know, Mama. Yeah. I don't even watch it. You're going to help people, yeah.